How can we solve this integral? Well, we see that we can't use the substitution method. However, we see we have an expression, a squared minus x squared. When we see this, we consider a trig substitution. In particular, trig substitutions are very useful if that expression is under a square root. There's three options for a trig substitution. Here we see we have the form a squared minus x squared, so we want to make the substitution that x is equal to a, which is 3 sine theta. Therefore, dx is equal to 3 cosine theta d theta. So now if we substitute into the square root of 9 minus x squared, we get the square root of 9 minus 3 sine theta squared is 9 sine squared theta. Factor out a 9. 1 minus sine squared theta is cosine squared theta. Applying the square root, we've got 3 cosine theta. So now making the full substitution, we've got 3 cosine theta in the denominator. x squared is 9 sine squared theta. And dx is 3 cosine theta d theta. Simplifying. And there we go. Now we just need to solve this integral. 